Hey everyone, Adam Shar here from Ververo Media Company. I'm sorry I haven't uploaded a video sooner. I've been really bogged down by my business. has been really, really doing well. Uh, I mean, I've practically almost doubled my business in like two months. And I really do apologize for not uploading more videos. I really uh, value you guys and, and, and I really want to bring you guys value and, and really good maps and history. I just, I had to, I got sidetracked, <laughs> understandably. But uh, I apologize for that, but I'm going to get onto a regular schedule, I promise. But right in front of you, I have a vintage map of Nova Scotia, more specifically a geological survey of Nova Scotia. Uh, and really what this map does is it shows you mineral deposits and it even shows you gold deposits. So for my fellow metal detecting friends out there, this might be a very, very useful map for you guys, uh, especially if you're in the Nova Scotia, uh, Eastern Canada area. Um, we're going to dive right in. We're going to zoom in and kind of explore and examine this old map. Um, so let's do that right now. Uh, obviously, we've got Nova Scotia right down the bottom at the top. Geological Survey 1906. So these findings are from 1906. We look over at the key on the left. All right, we've got a key. Now, the red kind of light red areas are granite. They're saying gold bearing series, which means a general possibility of gold in these kind of light green areas and then more specifically they have gold districts uh, in these these red dots these small red dots and then gold discoveries where they actually found gold uh, in these red hollowed out circles so if we look at this map already we'll, we'll start off with Halifax now Halifax if you go to the north of Halifax, I mean several gold districts all over the place, but actual gold discoveries uh, and with gold districts, I guess what they're saying is there's a, a, a high probability of gold back in 1906 uh, in these areas. So we've got uh, Montague uh, and Waverly, they're saying very good possibilities of gold in these areas, but if you go even more farther north, they actually found specific gold areas. They found gold discoveries right here at McKay Settlement. Very close to Windsor. Very close to Windsor. And Ar Ardois, Ardois, I can't, I, I'm not really good at pronunciation, but um, you can see that several locations to the north of Halifax. I mean, high, high chances of gold discovery. If you go to the east, again, you have several gold districts, Cow Bay, right along the coast, very close to Coal Harbor and Lawrencetown. And I mean, Clam Harbor, right, look right in Clam Harbor, right here, Clam Bay. I mean, you've got a hollowed out, you've got a, a gold district with a hollowed out circle. A uh, big, 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 big possibility of, of gold prospecting uh, down there. I mean, here's one named Gold Lake. I mean, obviously the name s says it pretty much all. Uh, it was originally named, I want to say S-E-K, Sakagi Lake. But I'm guessing they renamed it because they found uh, a good amount of gold deposits and they renamed it Gold Lake. Very close to Moose River. Uh, again, another gold district, Lindsay Lake. All of this is in red. And I mean, like, if you look at Halifax as a whole, I mean, look at the north. The northern area, man, I just see red all over the place. Red text. Not the, this, this is granite. The, the colored area, that's granite. But right here, the gold text, or I mean, the red text with the dots. Those are gold districts, and the hollowed out ones are definitely uh, gold discoveries. Falls, Lochaber, uh Beaver Dam's a gold district. Goldenville, I mean, <laughs> they named it Goldenville. 
I mean, really, really interesting uh, stuff here. Really to the north. I mean, you have to go really northeast uh, in uh, throughout Nova Scotia. Upper Seal Harbors. Seal Harbor. You, you can really see uh, a lot of these locations. 15 Mile Stream. Gay River. So, definitely a cool map that we have. I mean, you're more likely, if you're in Halifax, man, I would look to the, the, the northeast. I mean, scattered all over the place. Uh, high probability of prospecting for gold. When you get to the, the lower portions, I mean, if you go a little bit southwest of Halifax, there's some potential down here. 15. 15 Mite Brook, a uh, Greenfield. I mean, there's there's some good possibility in in these locations. Broad River, very close, getting closer to the coast. Even down o over closer, more south, southwest. Dominique Road, Cranberry Head. Those are uh, Cranberry and Cranberry Head right over here, right on the coast by Short Beach. They actually found gold discoveries, but it's less prevalent. Obviously, the more you, if you go north, it's more prevalent, less prevalent in the south, uh, southern areas. So, and also the coast. I mean, the gold regions tend to be hugging the coast much more. So, uh, I kind of wanted to share that map with you. I hope you've enjoyed it. And uh, you know, if you prospect for gold, I mean, man, uh, maps are great for for prospecting. For, for treasure hunting, I mean, you should absolutely use uh, these old maps. I mean, they, they're loaded with information and they will help you. They will help you. So uh, that being said, definitely subscribe to our YouTube channel. We do videos like these all the time where we look at old gold maps, maps of Halifax, of Nova Scotia, um, of Canada, uh, of different countries throughout entire, the entire world, old historical maps on Civil War battles. I mean, we, we have maps on everything. So if you like history, you like metal detecting, you like prospecting, you like treasure hunting, I mean, we're the channel for you. You should definitely subscribe to us. Give us a like. Leave a comment below if you have any questions about this map or uh, you'd like to comment about the different areas of Nova Scotia. I'd like to see what you guys have on feedback. Uh, definitely like this video, share this video, and subscribe to our YouTube channel, and I will see you guys soon. Okay, take care. All right, bye.